I'm gonna try not to hold you up all too, too long. But, good morning everyone. Welcome back to another. Y'all, we have made it to August. Birthday is in seven days, by the way, but you know, we ain't even gonna worry about none of that right now. Just put it in your calendars, August 9th. Congratulations, you are all doing very well in this class. I appreciate you. Since I don't wanna hold you up too long, what you've all been waiting for. Let's get right into the video. First things first, a lot of people aren't gonna tell you this, but I actually want you to be successful. And that one thing is confidence. It's important to have confidence because you don't wanna get up here and be talking like, oh yeah, so today we're gonna... I know I do this a lot, but you don't wanna be on here flicking with your fingers, looking around, saying, um, forgetting what you're about to say. Like, no, where's the confidence at? Like, you have to, if you're on here and you're about to be educating people, you gotta be about to be entertaining people, you need to come with the quality. If I was to click on a new YouTuber, and the first thing I see is, hey y'all, so today we're gonna be... I'm clicking off. One thing I recommend doing is practicing in front of a camera and just seeing and just seeing how you act. Like act like you're about to post this on YouTube and have a little fake video. It don't even have to be too long. It could be five minutes. Record something, see how you do, see if there's a lot of background interruption. Any problem you see in this demo video, make a solution by the time you start this YouTube channel. Number two, energy. Before I finish on this topic, I wanna say, it's okay to not always be okay. Everyone has their days when they're just down, and that's fine. But I feel like when it comes to building your audience, the first few videos they see should not be you depressing, bringing down the mood. If you find yourself recording a video and you're not really feeling it, there's no really big energy in it, then, don't finish it. Grab the video, start again the next day. You don't have to put it out, okay? Take some time to feel better, get your mental health together, and then try it again. But if you're on here to encourage, entertain, uplift, do anything for your viewers, don't start off doing the exact opposite. It's already, it's toxic. It's manipulating your audience before you even get a chance to build trust and love. My platform is to build a community, okay? We're all small businesses. We're all black-owned businesses trying to grow. We might not be all black-owned businesses, but we're all small businesses trying to grow. So I don't want to come on here being all sad and then next thing you know, you're be feeling sad out of nowhere. Like, you would feel that energy through my video. I'm not going to do that. Number three, have a target audience and stick with it. When finding your target audience, know what age range you're talking to. There's a lot of kids out here, meaning 10 to 14 year olds that are on here and they're looking at these YouTube videos, not even realize what they're watching and not even realize what the YouTubers are actually saying to them and it's already brainwashing them. So if you know that you're videos are going to maybe relate to tweens be as real and censored as possible shield them from the things you wouldn't want your 13 year old seeing or even if you have a little cousin a little sister if you wouldn't want them seeing this type of content then make it age restricted or at least put a disclaimer so parents even know what their children is looking at or what their children is getting into. Sometimes, you know, kids are bad and they'll look up, they'll click on this video like, ooh, she said 18 and up? Yeah, let me watch it anyways. Like, it's stuff like that. But then they can't hold it against you. They can't say, well, you didn't say anything. As long as you be like, hey, y'all, uh, this might be a little too grown. This, some of y'all might not take this well. Say it, say something. So they can be like, dang, maybe I shouldn't have watched this. Anything. Really kind of difficult to explain what I'm getting at, but if you know, you know. Number four. Excuse my French, but don't BS. Now that you have a target audience, you need to put rules one and two together. Confidence plus a big energy. You can't be hyping up your video saying, hey y'all, watch my YouTube channel, do this, do that. Like, y'all gonna love this. And then when they click on the video, 
it's not even funny there's little to no editing in it it's like you literally just recorded the video and posted it online that's not okay quality is everything research 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 this is what i would say find what you want to record with where you're going to record and what you're going to use to edit editing is really the big one it's the main one when it comes to starting a youtube channel look at multiple types of editing software don't just look at one and be like oh yeah i'm going with this even i didn't do that mm -mm. i would say start off with at least three see which one you like the most which one is easiest to you which one is more advanced to you like find something that you actually like don't just go off what anybody else is saying i'm gonna link a video of someone who rated a couple editing apps and that'll be some of your go-to's you can use that they should all be free but if not then my bad but still research and try out different editing softwares all on your own okay don't take no one's word for granted not even mine don't take it and run with it research this is your channel you want it to look nice so put the work in i personally use premiere rush pro it's part of adobe adobe i don't know i don't know how to pronounce that a d o b e if you plan on using this app whether you're using it on a mobile device or a laptop desktop you have to put the work in okay none of the stuff that i use in my video are gonna just come with the app no i'm looking at what i actually want to be in the video nine times out of ten i'm screen recording certain stuff they have a feature where if you screen record the sound on youtube you can separate audio and drop it in as an audio file i like that i just like it's a lot of stuff you could do with premiere pro i could link a video of how exactly you use premiere pro if you want me to make a video on how i edit one day then i'll do that no problem for the sake of this video it's not going to be done today and i'm not going to be making that video anytime soon but it's a really good editing software app it's a little bit on the advanced side but it's easy for beginners as well if you really try your hardest number five last but not least give it your all and be yourself yeah, you might want to do the trending videos. You want to do a fashion of a haul so bad. See all these videos that everyone else is doing. But if you really want to stand out and break the YouTube algorithm, you have to be different. Try your hardest to think of something that hasn't been done. And even if it has been done, do it 10 times better. Don't be like everyone else on here. We're all trying to grow and we all want to make it big on YouTube or social media in general but it's really not going to happen by doing the exact same thing as someone else i promise you the outcome will be amazing if you actually just take some time to put the work in no matter what your channel is about always be yourself there may be some other girls on here with the big energy they may be doing this in their videos they may be saying this in their videos acting like this acting like that the guys on their gaming channels they might be playing this game but you don't really play games like that that's okay. What's really gonna attract people is how they like you, not how you act regarding to someone else. Most of the people, most of the people that I watch on YouTube, I watch their videos because I enjoy their personality. I don't care what they're posting. It could be a game that I've never played in my life. They could be doing a clothing haul knowing I will never, ever, ever go on that website to buy their clothes. But because I like their content, because I like their personality, like I said, do it, a demo video, you know see how you act and if something's not right you need to change it before you actually start your official channel this video was quick i'm glad you all enjoyed this video i will say one thing before i leave youtube is not for everyone everyone's not gonna like editing for hours planning out your videos finding the right editing software and that's okay you can either try again or you can find something else to do there's a million things on this earth to make your mark and it does not always have to be youtube there's plenty of people who start youtube channels every single day and do not make it anywhere but don't let that discourage you okay a lot of them people they just wasn't cut out for it they didn't want to edit they didn't want to be like okay my phone isn't the best to record with let me try to save up and get a new one if you really have a passion for making youtube videos you're going to find a way to make it work and for those of you who are not don't even attempt. Honestly, don't waste your time. Time is so valuable and you could be doing so many other things. The time that it takes you to record and edit a video that isn't gonna do anything, you could have posted a video of you singing online and been famous like that. Like, just don't waste your time. You don't know how many opportunities you're wasting by wasting your time and doing pointless things that you know you're not really cut out for. 
and that's just the reality of it thank you all for watching this video i'm gonna catch you in the next one welcome to august and happy birthday to everyone who is a leo this is our season listen i know i said i don't like zodiac signs but i'm not ready to be disrespectful what's up leo happy birthday we don't really bang with the july leos like that august is where it's at that's all shine prove to everyone that this is really and truly leo season and i'm gonna see you in the next video peace love y'all can't wait to see how your channels turn out see you later everyone